Yo, it's your boy coming on, and uh, it's a cold ass morning, bro. It's cold as heck. It's like 22 degrees out here. But I wanted to put this video up because I'm on my way to the gym. Um, I wanted to talk to you guys about one itis and how men have to find a way to never have one itis. Okay? One itis is basically a man thinking that the one that he's with is the only one that will ever accept him, love him and want to be with him, okay? We we quickly fall in line with one-itis. We quickly fall in line with one-itis. And it's, and, and it's by design, right? We bond with our women, and once we bond, we, 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 we shut that part of ourselves off, all right? Um, that's a beta male type of move. Let's be real, that's a beta male type move. Beta males, or let me say, let me say this, Men who have a very high moral standard when it comes down to relationships quickly get one-itis, okay? Men who do not have a high moral standard when it comes down to relationships do not get one itis As a matter of fact, these men tend to always have a female in the back pocket somewhere just in case. They think more on the lines of a woman. They're always talking to women, they're always practicing their lines, they're always sharpening their sword. And uh, that's a great way to keep you from making heavy, heavy mistakes in your relationship. All right. Now, is there a hybrid? Is there a way for a man to be morally uh, navigated, right? Morally focused on relationships and still have the whole back in the side pocket type woman without actually doing it? Yes, there is. It's called having a life, okay? Having a life will give you the, 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 the luxury of always being able to move on if you need to. Because here's the thing, once a relationship is over, the man is the last to know, okay? Once a relationship is over, the man is the last to know. So it's, it's vital that you as a man have a life outside of work, have a life outside of your family, have a life outside of her. Because if you don't have a life outside of her, when you realize that the relationship is over, you're going to be fighting your butt off trying to hold on to something that you cannot hold on to and that's painful it's already hard enough to realize that your relationship is coming to an end that's already hard enough as it is that's hard enough but to know to be the last man standing <laughs> if you will holding the bills holding everything and then on top of that you find out that the woman that you love with all your heart doesn't want you anymore it's it's soul crushing it breaks the man's spirit. Once you see that she's pulling away, right? And you have one, once you see that she, once, wait, let me just move phrase that. Once you notice that she's pulling away and you have a life, you can then start to protect yourself, all right? Because it comes a time in every man's life to realize that, listen, and I heard this from, um, I think it was uh, Dave Chappelle who said it. Sometimes you have to show that you're a lion so you could be a lamb. Right? And I, that, that stuck with me when I heard it. I was like, holy crap. He said that his mom said that. Sometimes you have to show that you are a lion in order to be a lamb. Because I'm a lamb with a lion spirit. Okay? Most of us men we have a lion spirit within us but we, we we fail to 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 prove to everybody else that we're we're lions because we don't want to be lions like i don't want to chew people up i don't want to do that it's not in my nature to do so well maybe it is in my nature but i have never i've been civilized my entire life so i don't know what it's like to not be civilized i don't know what it's like to go out and sleep with a whole crap of women and not give a damn about any one of them i don't know what that's like let's be honest i i i, I went from my mother to marriage 
so I don't know what that's like. But uh, yeah, my point to you is this. Do not get one-itis. This is a five minute video. I'm trying to keep it short and street. Do not get one-itis. Pull your ass out of one-itis right now. Before you get to a point where you make yourself unattractive to your woman. One-itis is by far the most unattractive thing a man can ever do to show that he needs his woman, right? To show that I need you right now because needing a woman is like a problem. I don't know what it is, but for some strange reason in their brain, you needing them, turn them off. It makes them, I don't know, whatever, you know? I don't know what it is, how, what, what, what happens in their psyche, but you cannot need your woman. You needing your woman is not a good thing. She, she, she needing you is one thing, right? That's one thing, but you needing her, bruh, that's a problem, you know? So don't fall into the trap of needing your woman. Don't, don't fall in that trap. Uh, get a damn life. <laughs> you know, I'm rambling now, so I'm gonna get off. This is Gary Lamb signing off. You guys have a good one.